Hey everyone, this is Laura, your Jam Jar Junkie, back with another episode. Today we'll be painting a popular Valentine gnome jar. I'm going to paint my whole jar first while I put the pattern down on it this time. I place a piece of paper under my jar so it's easy for me to turn the jar and get to the areas that I need to. And it keeps paint from getting all over your table. It's up to you if you want to paint the bottom of the jar or not. While you're waiting for your paint to dry, you can pick a pattern that you like for your gnome. I will just be outlining the gnome and using it as a basic guideline. You'll need a white piece of copy paper to trace him. We do not have to have contact paper for this project. And then you can cut it out. We are just going to tape our down very gently. Only use a small piece of tape so that you don't pull your paint off your jar. The pattern didn't turn out quite like I wanted it to, but that's okay. We're just going to channel our inner Bob Ross and paint right over that and keep going.
I'm going to cut out and glue just a few of these little red and pink hearts around on our gnome jar to put our hearts on our jar. We're going to use a little bit of Mod Podge. So the only thing I think is missing is maybe some lace around the top. Add that since it's Valentine's Day. We will do some pink lace. And there you have it guys, in your little gnome jar. Add some flowers to it, store spoons and forks in. I think napkins. Like always guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it.